What's up guys, Desert B here and welcome back to The Legend of Zelda The Wind Waker. We're uh, on our way back to the Forbidden Fortress. It's a uh, rematch with Ganondorf time. <laughs> Just kidding, like we actually had any kind of a chance when we were there before. I don't even know that he even said anything to me, really. I think he just was like, I think he just like, he did that thing with his head, you know, and was like off with his head and chucked me right out to sea. So, um, get this chest here to replenish my funds. Oh yeah. So yeah, last episode, um, wait, wrong way. Last episode we did, uh, we did get the Master Sword, which was pretty exciting. And then, I'm pretty sure that was last episode. And then we also got, uh, this sail. So we're like flying across the ocean now. It's crazy. Here's the fish. Whoa, these are new. Um, I want to fill the map in. And there's also a little tiny island here. Whoa, what is with these, dude? Oh my gosh! <laughs> they knocked me right out of the boat! What the heck? Uh, I can like barely swim in this water. And then the boat just kept going without me. Wow, okay, note to self. Don't mess around with those. So let me get into my bait bag, get some bait out. Now that, um... Now that I'm able to sail so quickly, I I can definitely, I'll be filling in my map like ASAP. So go ahead and do the thing. What do we got? One tiny little island here. Okay. I hear that somewhere out in the wide world is a handy arrow that can freeze anything. With something like that, you could even freeze that nasty monster in the Forsaken Fortress. For a while, anyway. But then, what would you do with a frozen monster, you say? Good question. Why, I'd say you'd give that thing a whack and watch it shatter into tiny pieces. Wow. Okay, so... Somebody told me, I think it was one of these fish, told me where to get the ice arrows at an, like, I don't know, when I talked to him at some other time. So let me see what's up here. Just real quick. Also, this is a pretty useful tip that um, somebody in my Discord told me about. Um, Hyrule Postman actually was the one who mentioned it that in the map, so I can't show you because I really can't open the map, but um, on your gamepad, or if you don't have a gamepad, it's just in your map option, you can actually reread the fish's um, tips from the map. So you don't actually have to feed them the bait more than once, which is actually great news because I've already fed a couple of those fishes twice because I wanted them to tell me what the tip was again because I had forgotten. I didn't even realize that you could actually just click on the fish in your map screen and it'll tell you again. Where are we? Oh, this is creepy. Oh, well, these are, these are, these are those things. Oh, I forgot what to do. Oh, that wasn't it. <laughs> Let me see if they'll actually die. Ow. A bunch of loot here. Ow! Okay. Hold on. I'm distracted. I probably shouldn't be messing around with anything. We should just be going straight to the Forsaken Fortress Island because it's probably going to end up opening up um, like a whole big story thing. But I'm just so curious about some of this stuff, you know? Like, I, I want to explore a little bit. What is this? Is this like a, a gauntlet or something? Now these guys are gonna come out of here. And then maybe one, something else will come out of the front one. And maybe we'll end up getting like a heart piece or something, you know? Something nifty. And yep, the big pigs. I kinda like the pigs. They're cute. With their floppy bottom lips. <laughs> Wow, okay. 
Oh, he's not dead. Oh! Straight out of the air. What? Come on, I thought he couldn't block my jump like that. Dude. Got him. Now what? Oh, yeah. I bet we're getting a heart piece. Nice. Okay, that was totally worth. You get all the loot. What's it gonna be? Oh yeah, and I think that gave us an extra container. Nice, okay. Sweet. So, yeah, the other thing that I think I wanna do ASAP is help out these Koroks. So I, I bet that there's gonna be something similar maybe under each of these rocks, but I'm gonna be back here because we're gonna have to do this anyways. So, where are we? We're way on the north side, just outside of the Forsaken Fortress. So we'll come back here and we'll do all these um, all at the same time. But let's see, we need to turn completely around. Watch out for those, jeez. So last time we were here, we came in with the pirates and they launched us um, into the fortress. So let's see what the method's gonna be to get in this time. Looks like they've got the spotlights activated again. So what do I do? I don't necessarily wanna be I don't want to be spotted, I don't think. Is there somewhere to land? Here's a big door. I wonder if I could go through that. It's probably not. It's closed, but let's let's just see. Oh boy. <laughs> okay, let's <laughs> let's go back. Um He did say to come back to Forsaken Fortress. Hold on. Oh, what's this? There's a guy up here. It's that guy that's all over the place with his um, looking glass. Let me get closer. Okay, that'll do it. I wanna, let me see what the boat says. Why do you delay? We must head for the Forsaken Fortress. That We're here! <laughs> Frightening. <laughs> yeah, I guess so. I don't know what he's looking at. Um... I don't know. I thought something bigger was going to happen when we got here. Like... I was going to get some kind of a cutscene or something. I don't even know how to get in. Should I just get spotted? Like, what happens if I get spotted? Nothing. Okay. Let me look at the map. Uh, it doesn't seem particularly helpful. Okay, maybe I just should... Okay, this is so fast. I can't get over how fast this sail is. But, um... Let me get out and let me look at... Maybe this guy's seeing an entrance or something. Items, looking glass... This is an old wrecked boat, which is pretty crazy. That's the... I think this is the jail, maybe? I've, I can't really remember. How to gain entry is the big bird nest. Dude, we're here! King of Red Lions, tell me what to do! Why is he, like, all of a sudden not telling me? 
Let me see about that door. That's the only thing. Let's try bombing the door. That's the only thing I can really think of. Oh, this thing is going so fast that the, um, like, U-turning in this thing is impossible. There's no such thing. Okay, here we go. Bombs. Bombs away! Oh, that did it. That did it. Okay, great. In we go. I guess. I don't know that it's a great idea to... Be coming right in the front door, but here we are. Ganon has likely been made aware of our little incursion already, but you have the master sword. The sword shall shine in the darkness, casting back evil with it in your hands. None can keep you from rescuing your sister. Do not be afraid. Ooh -hoo -hoo! I like it. That was um that was reassuring. That was a nice little pep talk. None can keep you from rescuing your sister. I guess. Hey, what are these? These weren't here before. Ow, what the? Hmm. Hold on a minute. Um, we gotta think through this. This, oh. <laughs> what is this? Is this like a phantom Ganon? Oh, wait a minute, I'm not ready for this. I'm just a kid. Where are you? Ah, wait. Oh, he sounds... Sounds angry. Okay, I need to... I, I know what I need to do, but let's figure it out. Oh, listen to the music. Okay, this is bringing back memories. Ocarina of Time memories. <laughs> yes. Uh oh. Oh my gosh, I can't. The sound effects even are like, they're, oh, they're so perfect. Oh yes. Yeah, like the sounds that he's making, the sounds, uh, the whole thing, it's amazing. It's making my inner child happy. Ooh, ooh, the music. Oh, you got him. Look at that sword. So... Oh, you're just gonna let me in. I guess I passed the test, so now the whole fortress is open to me. Ooh. So I wonder if Ganondorf then knows uh, that I'm here. I mean, I guess? I would guess that that was more than just a booby trap. The skull hammer, set it and use it with any buttons. This mighty hammer can break things and pound obstacles into the ground. Ah, look at the design of this thing. Skull hammer. I'm waiting for its face to come back around. That's insane. Some enemies even get stunned by the shock waves it cause when you pound the ground. What's that? Oh, the, the devils. The little fawns. Okay, let's check out this new item. Whoa! No, 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 no. Oh, wait. Oh, I thought I was going to go to jail. Let's put that over here. <laughs> Oh gosh, it's a little bit slow, but that was priceless. Okay, that explains what these are then. <laughs> wow, okay, that is so cool. Okay, it's a little bit slow, but our new fun toy. It's a little bit weird to get an item from Ganon's castle. Okay, what the heck? Is this like an endless supply of demons? Um, do I have a map? I do, I do. I think we're just gonna go straight back up to the jail. 
And I don't even need to really care or worry about... Though... Oh, you know what? Actually... Oh, I forgot. The door opened for me. That's where I should be going. I'm, like, retracing my steps, I guess, from the first time that we were here, but we don't even need to worry about that. The spotlights don't seem to care. Ooh, Ganon's gonna be shaking in his boots. I've got the Master Sword in my hand. He doesn't even know what's coming. Well, he probably has an idea. Whoa! Excuse me. <laughs> when did they get that ability? Okay, awesome. The enemies are... They're increasing in power and stuff now. Um... Oh, check it. Okay, so we want to go this way, definitely. What was that? What? He just threw fire or something. Let me see if I can stun him. Nope. Oh, jeez. Ah! Okay, this is not... This isn't working. Oh, my gosh. Good grief. These little, these little rats are really, really my problem here. What if I just run? What do you think? Wow, they like light the place on fire when they have an intruder. Whoa, what's that? Oh my gosh! No way! It's like, is that like the birth of the gloom hands? <laughs> that was crazy. All right, we're going for it. See, look, he's gonna... Oh, he doesn't even see me. He throws the fire. That's crazy. And then up. Oh, the pig thing, though. Actually, yeah, we do need to go up, I think. Oop, not on the bed. Because we're on the first floor... No, Link! I had this problem the first time we were here. Okay. I kinda... Well, I know that this is not the big bad bass... The, I can't speak. The big bad boss fight because... Hold on. I think I'm trying to decide where I need to go. Because there's still something else that we're going to have to go around and collect just because I see it on the map. Red X. We need to go toward the red X on the map, which is back out this way. Anyways, um, there's something else in the collection in the item screen that looks like we're going to have something else to do still. So, like, I know this isn't the end, so I'm kind of like, how prepared do I really need to go in here? Um, should I be worried? How do I get over there? Huh. Maybe I got to go all the way around. Because, like, I have that potion from Link's grandma still that I could use. It gives you, like, times two attack, but, um, until you take damage. But I just don't know if we're going to actually do any fighting or if Ganon is going to basically, like, just chuck me off the island again. Also, are we going to save Errol? Like, is it going to be a thing where we're going to save Errol and she gets to go home, but then we're basically, like... We're not going to let this guy survive because he's pure evil. Mm. And that would be, like, the thing to do. That would be, like, a very Link thing to do. How do I get over there? Oh! Very nice. How do I... Get over there. Well, that's one way to do it, I guess. <laughs> I can't get over this hammer. That is so cool. My item um, screen is filling up pretty good now, too. I've got 
one, two, three more spots, I think. And maybe like two more bottle spots. So potentially three more items in this game somewhere. Okay, I don't remember this floor being so broken apart. Like there's no way for me to get over there. I can't use the f the leaf, can I? Oh, no way. Dude. Neat. Neat. So, we're back outside. Hold on. Oh, um, hmm, pig statue. That's new, I think. I don't remember seeing that the last time I was here. Okay, let's just go for it. Okay, this is the room with the big door that we gotta go out. Ah, right in the fire. Nice. And then the jail should be somewhere up here. More of those devils, I hear them. Oh, they walk on the walls, creepy. And they just keep coming. So, let's see. When we went up to the jail the last time, we had to, um, nope, it wasn't down there. I'm trying to remember where we went. Why are they just letting me, um, infiltrate their prison, their fortress? Oh, yeah, yeah, here we go. Items. Okay, please. And I want this over here. Now we know what to do with those um, switches. There was this some island that I stopped at where there was this, um, like, a puzzle. There was these switches, and then I couldn't figure out what to do with them. That was them. So now we can probably solve whatever that was. Magic and arrows. Okay, more of this. Sidling. Oh, they're shooting at me! Ah! What? What do I do? Ah! What? So, I do need to disable the lights? Oh, what? Okay, where's that big door? Okay. Wow. Hmm. Let me see. Let me see. Where? Let's go back to the map. Where am I? I'm on floor one. I think I want to go this way. I kind of just want to run. I, like I don't want to fight all these guys. We'll disable the lights once we get to the second floor. Ah! Gloom hands! <laughs> then through here, this will be... Yep, here we go. Ladder up to the second floor. And up again. Then... So I'm curious... I don't know. Let me just go this way. Because I gotta disable those lights, so I think I'm gonna need to go all the way around and, like, take care of these. Or maybe just whichever one shines over in that direction, which could be this one. Let's find out. Alright. You! Whoa! Okay. So... Ah, I need that one to be disabled. 
So that's um, the southeast corner. So there's a ladder. I'm trying to figure out how to get up there. I wonder if. Hmm, here's one too. I don't know if I should just do them all or what. I guess we might as well. Since we're here, and then... And l let me go back... Well, here's a corridor. Let me see where I go. Is there a ladder? Nope. Nope. Hmm, let's see. Gotta put your shield up, dude. So I am... I came from that door. I'm right under where I need to be. So here's the thing. Let's glide across. Okay. Ow! Jeez. Let's see if we can find a ladder outside. No ladder. Well, there's a path. Oh, here we go. And this is the one that we need to disable. It didn't seem like they were really bothering me before. Like, I wasn't being attacked or anything until I got on that little ledge. And then all of a sudden they were like after me. Okay, so now let's... Oh, I wish I could reach that. Can I? If only. So back in. And I want to go this way. And glide across. Gosh, it's kind of crazy being back here now with all these new crazy items that we have. Everything seems so different and plus they've made little changes now too they put like extra um precautions and stuff out like those switches so that's pretty cool and now here we are i'm just gonna run past it because we already fought that thing once okay here come the little devils with their big old buck deep. I guess they are dropping a lot of hearts. Let me grab that. Okay, then... Oh my word, there's so many! Little demons. I think they're fawns, I think. You know, like, uh... That always makes me think of Mr. Tumnus from The Lion, the Witch, and the Wardrobe. He was a fawn. Okay. Are we safe or not? I don't know. Okay, we're not. We're not. Alright, sidle Link. Do it. Okay, Link, you gotta go, man. The devils are after us. <laughs> We're here to save Errol. I'm thinking, here's what I think. I think we might actually save Errol and and then Link is just going to be like basically tasked with uh, defeating Ganondorf and we'll be back or maybe Ganondorf goes somewhere else and then we have to go find him somewhere else I don't know but I think Errol's here's like my prediction I guess is Errol's gonna get to go home but we're gonna keep 
pursuing Ganondorf because that's just what somebody like Link would do. I mean, now we've got the Master Sword and everything. We can't just quit now. But what the other items are, I don't know. Errol! We're back! Are we gonna be snatched up by the bird again? <laughs> Big brother! Oh look, and it's the other people from the island. You're okay! I was worried. Oh, Not even... Oh. The cell won't open that easily. Oh, it's the pirates! What are they doing here? There you go, acting before you think, as usual. She's got, like, some crazy um, say so over these guys. I swear, do you even realize that we had to draw that monster bird off for you? I was wondering about the bird. It was about to come flying in here after you again. What's that face for? Oh, she sees the master sword. She knows some that sword. Where did you get that? Are you? Is it even possible? How could it be? What's that face? Well, never mind about that. For now, we'll just take these girls. I'm sure their fathers back in town will pay a handsome reward for their return. <laughs> they're just carrying them off. <laughs> like they're prisoners. Look at her. She's adorable. <laughs> He's adorable. I'm so sorry to interrupt such a heartwarming reunion. But isn't there still something that you need to take care of? I, if you're worried about your sister, don't be. I promise I'll deliver her safely back to your little island. Normally, I'd expect a huge reward for something like this, but this time it's my treat. <laughs> oh, excuse me. Listen, Errol, your brother still has some things to take care of. Big, important, grown-up things. He'll be back soon. So you just wait nice and quiet until he returns, okay? But, big brother... Okay, the music. Miss Tetra, we have to hurry. The bird will be here any second. Gonzo, excellent. You're just in time. Take this one for me. Isn't Gonzo the name of the guy who does the repairs in Skyloft and Skyward Sword? But she's... She's fine. Just do as you're told. They're gonna t carry off Errol. Big brother! <laughs> and then she's gonna leave me here. Link, we'll be back. I swear it. Uh huh. There's the bird. Oh, I'm locked in. Is it filling with water? Oh no! They're gonna flood me. Oh gosh. Whoa. Are we fighting the bird in the water? Don't tell me, please, no. No, 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 no. That sounds bad, like a bad idea. I want to be on solid ground. Oh no, what have, what have I done? Get up there, Link. What do I do? Let me think about what kind of items I have. Um, I've got the bow, that'd be useful, probably. Whoa, it's... Okay, it's immune to those, hey. It's immune to arrows. Is it breaking the bridge? I'm just gonna climb. Oh, hearts. Whoa! Just can't go out that door. Oh, that was barely in time. Link, you gotta go. Ooh okay, get out of my way, get out of my way. What if I fall? Does the bridge come back? Oh my gosh! Oh my word! What? What do I do? Hello? Bird. Oh, stun it. Mighty hammer. Um... Oh! 
Nice. Okay, I don't know. Um, I think what the fish told us earlier is going to be important about using a frost arrow or an ice arrow. But I don't have those. Closing me off. He knows I'm coming. Oh, my word. Never mind. Those tail feathers, though. Pretty cool. Oh, this is a boss fight arena. Are we fighting the bird? I think we are, yeah. Here he comes. Eek! Coming in hot. Let's see, what do I, what should I try here? Oh, jeez. Link, you gotta swing the thing. Where'd he go? Where'd he go? Yeah. It's not working. Yeah. It's not doing anything. What if I, um, shoot him with arrows? Let's try. Nope. Whoa, whoa. Um, jeez. I think I need to wait for him to, like, try to peck me or something. Arrows aren't working. Oh, wrong, wrong thing. I'm gonna put bombs out here, too. It could maybe be the boomerang? Oh, he's coming. Hold on, something's happening. This is different. Ah, there we go. Did we stun him? I think. I don't know, actually. Ah! Holy moly. Okay, how did I get him to do that? Whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> okay. Awesome. Come in for the landing. <laughs> it's hitting the wall. I don't know. I don't know if this is helping or not, but it, it's entertaining for sure. <laughs> Oh, wait a minute. Weren't there... Well... I don't know. Oh, here he comes. Come on. Wait for him to peck. Okay. Perfect. I think this is actually working. Oh, boy. The bird kind of looks like Ganondorf a little bit. It's like big chested. Let's see what's next. Come in for the landing. Nope. <laughs> I don't know how many times he's going to do this. Um, I think he's coming in for the landing. Okay. Come on. Come on. Do the thing. Great. And then... Oh. He's wearing a mask. What? Since when? Is this working? Oh, look at that. Is he going to try to peck me again? Not a good idea, dude. They don't have any head protection. Aww. I just had like a, a... A bad thought because... There was this, um... If you guys played Banjo-Kazooie, right? Um, which is like my favorite game ever. There's this bird, Eerie, that you take care of. And you... You... Oh. And fair. Yes! Oh, the full moon! Look at that! <laughs> Why are all the spotlights turning on it? Oh! 
We defeated it. I wasn't expecting that. I thought we would have a rematch with it. Just because of what the fish said. Okay, Ganondorf, we're coming for ya. Anyways, the bird Eerie in Banjo-Kazooie, you like feed it and it grows up. So basically you raise a great eagle and then it flies off. And I was just like, oh, what if this bird was that bird? And it's like, I raised it. Cause the way it sounded for a second, I was like, oh, Eerie, my bird. And it made me sad. There he is. Look at that cloak. It's been a while, boy. You've done well to sneak into my fortress and wriggle your way all the way up here. I suppose the least I can do is command you, commend you for your reckless courage. My name is Ganondorf, and I am the master of the Forsaken Fortress. <laughs> so ugly. Link is, uh concerned. By the way, boy, when you drew that sword of yours out of its pedestal, did you by chance notice how all the monsters frozen in time down there suddenly began stirring again? Do you understand precisely what that means? I highly doubt you do. Foolish child, while that sword is indeed the blade of evil's bane, at the same time it has long played another role. You see, it's also a sort of key, a most wretched little key that has kept the seal on me and my magic intact. By withdrawing the blade, you've broken that seal. Oh gosh, that was unintentional. <laughs> Link! Oh boy, it's so bad they can't even show us <laughs> what happened. What did happen? This man is humongous. Oh, you cannot defeat me with a blade that does not sparkle with the power to repel evil. You, what you hold is useless. Go back to the world below and tell that to the pathetic fools who made this blade. Its power is gone, and its edges are dull. Ah! Oh! Tetra! <laughs> what? Link, get up! Ah! Stop! Let me go! You pathetic little sea rat! Oh! My Triforce power is resonating. At long last, I have found you, Princess Zelda. <sighs> what? What are you talking about? I don't know any Zelda. Aiding ignorance will gain you nothing. Tell me, if you are not Zelda, then why do you have this fragment of the Triforce? Tetra Zelda! What? What just happened? Oh, it's our friends! The Rito! <laughs> we just got snatched out of there like Frodo and Samwise got saved by the eagles at the end of Lord of the Rings! And it's Valu! What? <laughs> this is amazing! This is the best rescue mission I've ever been a part of! Oh, yes! Get him, Valu! This is amazing! <laughs> no way. I didn't expect that at all. I thought we were going to fight him and then die and then maybe Tetra go to jail. Zelda, I mean. It's all right, Link. She's merely lost consciousness. Your sister has escaped the Forsaken Fortress with the pirates. You can relax. She's safe now. Lord Valu, you arrived not a moment too soon. We're deeply grateful. Look at this dragon! I can't believe it flies with those little wings. I am aware of this. Yet, I thought our first priority should be to separate these two from Ganon's grasp. What's he saying? I, there's no way. Those wings would not lift something like that. Valu, that was so cool to get to see Valu in action. 
Never expected him to leave his perch. Link, I will explain things later. Now we must return to the world beneath the sea. Dude, I feel like I need an explanation. Like now, where did they take Tetra? Okay, so I did know that Tetra was Zelda. I didn't know how it was gonna be revealed though. That was so cool. Oh, ow. Link, you're all right? What is this place? Hey, and Ganondorf, what happened to him? <laughs> Link, what are you doing? You must come to the room where you got the master sword. And who's using that stone? Just who are you? Link and I are the only ones who can speak through this stone. How dare you use what's not yours? Your name is Tetra, correct? You must come with Link to see me at once. Huh, well, don't you sound important. Fine, we're on the way. Just hold your horses, whoever you are. Link, what are you waiting for? You heard the stone. You're supposed to show me how to get to that, where the voice is. All right. We've got, we've got a companion! <laughs> and it's Zelda, but she's Tetra. <laughs> this is crazy. Okay, guys, well, we're going to leave off here. Thanks so much for watching. That was a crazy ending to this episode. Did not expect that at all. Um, and really excited to see what's going to happen down here. I thought... Okay, this whole time, I thought that it was... Tetra talking to me or the King of Red Lions talking to me in this little thingy. I I don't even know who's talking to me now. Anyways, thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one. Goodbye. I'm Brittany with Desert Bee Games. Thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video and you'd like to help my channel grow, all you gotta do is hit the like and subscribe buttons below. If you'd like to see your name at the end of every video, please consider joining channel memberships right here on YouTube. Can't wait to see you there.